I got this meeting I gotta go to, and I gotta be looking good. Sometimes you just gotta improvise. Dustin, yeah. Dustin, Dustin. What? I'm done with the restroom. It's ready for you. What do I need a restroom for? I got the biggest mirror on the lot. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What? 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 Whatever. Whatever. Oh yeah, looking good, looking good. Let's go have some fun. Great work is mandatory. It's a must. If you want to continue to grow and you want to get to the goals that you have set forth, then you have to put out great work. It's got to be the best. What's up guys and welcome back to Shop Talk. Have you ever been driving down the road and seen one of these big guys just shining like a mirror? I'm talking about like a polished diamond. All the metal on it's absolutely beautiful. Well today, I'm going to show you how we take aluminum that's dull and oxidized and just not so pretty and make it absolutely beautiful. But actually, I'm going to take it a step further. You know, this big truck isn't big enough. So today, we're taking it a step further. I mean, I want to show you how Easy N does it big boy style. We've been tasked with polishing out all this metal on this crane. The wheels, the diamond plate, the boxes, everything. And boy, is it going to be a job, but it's going to be a lot of fun to show you just how we can take it from this to absolutely perfection. So I know you got to be wondering, where do you even start? Well, I'm going to tell you. So step one is we got to get all this metal cleaned up. We use a product called Aluminum Bright, and we're going to spray that acid all over this metal. We're going to scrub it really clean, and we're going to rinse it off. And that's going to take off all the debris, the dirt, the road grime, the asphalt, everything that's sitting on this metal that's going to keep us from wanting to polish it out really nice, it's going to strip it down. Then we do a good soap wash to neutralize that acid. We don't want to leave acid sitting on here etching into the metal. So we use a good soap, we scrub it up, and rinse it down just like we would if it was your car. And we can't forget about these bad boys. They need some love too. Basically the same process. Every now and then we'll use a little degreaser if they're built up with grease and road grime. But then we'll hit it with acid, we'll wash it off, and then finish with soap. We always want to neutralize. We don't want to leave this acid sitting in here etching to the metal, causing more problems for the owner. And now that we get all that done, we go right on into polishing. I happen to have some of my guys already polishing on this truck right now. Let's go take a look. In order to get a big job done like this, you gotta have a heavy hitting crew. And that's what I got working on this job. They got the big polishers too, our big rotary DeWalt buffers, and they need big equipment. So we slap a wool pad on these buffers. We use our metal polish as a liquid. We put all over the diamond plate, and then we turn them on and polish this stuff out. But this ain't a job for the lighthearted. This is a dirty job. These guys are gonna have black soot all over them from head to toe because these things sling stuff everywhere. Now I know I said we needed the big guns, but listen, we need the small ones too. On wheels like this, they have intricate areas and we gotta have special equipment to get inside there. So I got my best wheel polisher over here really polishing out this metal, making sure it shines just like it's supposed to.
as always, the Easy In team just absolutely knocked this one out of the park. I mean, they got this diamond plate all polished up, got the toolboxes, the fuel tank polished up. They took it a step further and even cleaned out the cab so these drivers have something nice to ride around in. And who can forget the wheels? I mean, they look the best, all shined and polished out. I mean, man, these things look good. Ooh, that's a good look. You know I'm talking about the wheels. Listen, if you got a set of aluminum wheels and you need them polished out, you know what to do. Head on over to EZNDetail.com and click Get My Estimate. That's going to do it for this episode of Shop Talk, and I'll see you next week. I can feel it, dog. <laughs> what? What? Ah, okay, I know that. I was wondering. Oh, what am I trying to say? What? 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 Whatever. Whatever. Oh, is it dripping on my shirt? Okay. <laughs> so I got my heavy kit. Oh, What do you mean, what am I talking about? What do you mean? What do you mean? What? What? <laughs> that was great, but um, I needed one more time.